Oh, howdy diddly dandy there, Charms to Zai, Captain of the Steves, and today Charms for you guys, aren't there? In the view of us, I'm back in Towers of Agaspa, and I'm, I'm not too sure what I'm going to do today. I mean, I took on the Withered yesterday, you can see there, I killed like, what, four Withered snags? I also did pretty well against something else, let me have a quick look, see. So if I go to the Joel Journal... I've actually taken out six of the ten withered soldiers, and I'm hoping to do a bit more of that tonight when I go live with my friends, perhaps. Um, I don't really want to do any of these later quests until I've managed to do these ones up here. So I think I'm going to be trying to climb that mountain again. Now inside of my inventory, I do have these two that are going to help me recover moderate amounts of stamina. I still don't think it's going to get me up that mountain, but I'm hoping. You know that I met with that Sky God in the previous episode, a couple of episodes back. I'm hoping that they're there and they fly me up there. That'd be freaking helpful of them, wouldn't it? But it's probably not going to be a thing, to be honest. Now, you can see here I've got a load of iron tools with me, as well as my stone tools. Now, on the radial wheel, I've left the stone tools on there. And it automatically swaps to the iron tools as and when I need them. I'm going to use the stone tools as much as I can. I've also worked out why the arrows weren't working. You have to actually equip them over here. Okay, so oh, if you can see the back of me like that. Watch the back of me here. If I take these arrows off, they're not there anymore. Oh, dang it. Now I have to equip them again. All right, so they're over here somewhere now. There they are. So you have to equip them. So you press X. And that should put them... Oh, for fudge sake. Where are they gone now? Man, this game, it doesn't make things easy, does it? It really doesn't make things easy. Ah, uh, I've lost my arrows now. They've, they've freaking vanished. Oh, that took me ages to craft them. Oh, please say they've gone inside this chest or something. No, I've only got my flint arrows in there. Well, where the... How did my epoxy arrows go? All right, I can get the iron bow out. And yeah, look, no ammo. Well, I did have ammo until five seconds ago when... Ah, oh, imagine heck. I to craft more arrows. Well, showing you how to equip arrows. That was freaking weird. I don't know why my arrows just vanished. Now, anyway, I reported it over on um, the old Zen desk that my arrows wouldn't automatically go to the arrows that I had. And I said, that's because you haven't equipped them. I've got the bow in my hand. Why Why would I need... What, make this easy. Oh, now I haven't got enough iron. Right, OK. Well, I have no idea where my arrows freaking went. Because they're, they're, not, they're not in here anywhere. That's really freaking tetchy, isn't it? Let's have a look through. Yeah. They just disappeared. So you unequipped something. Gone forever, apparently. Gone forever. That's really freaking weird. Right, well, I've already done this once this morning. I'm now on the hunt for iron. And we're going to go get a load of iron. Any, any, any old iron. Okay, after smashing a billion rocks, here we go. I can make myself some iron arrows that I already had before. Lovely. Now when I go into here... Oh... I still have no arrows. Oh, look, they've automatically equipped them. They're over there. And they're actually on my back automatically. There you go. I'm not going to freaking mess around with them for fear that they might vanish again. But yeah, you have to have them equipped before you can use them. Even if you've got the bow in your hand and even if they're in your inventory, they have to be equipped. OK, got that. Uh, right. So I'm going to hit a save now. Okay, map. I want to go all the way over there. Obviously, I can't set a custom waypoint. I've just got to head west and hopefully go there. There's an island over here. That's an interesting looking island, isn't it? But anyway, we're going to go there. We're going to go west. Go west. Da -da 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 -da. Go west. I'll see you there, people. That mountain I couldn't climb before. We're going to try and climb today. Hey, chums, I managed to ride my donkey all the way up here. Um, that was unexpected. So now what I'm thinking is I could go across there, maybe climb up there, and then maybe glide over to where I need to be, is what I'm thinking. So 
maybe I went about it the wrong way. Maybe you've got to go about it the long way to make it the short way. If that makes any sense at all. Come on, get up there. Don't freaking fall now! Oh my days! Freaking climb! Ooh Sometimes shouting at the screen helps massively in this game, okay? If you find yourself shouting massively at this game, you're doing it right! Okay, let's head on over this way then. Ah, uh -huh. look, there's a broken bridge there. This is definitely the way I should have come before. And it looks like there might be something over there, and I think that's where I've got to go to. Holy mackerel. Why didn't I think of doing this like the other day when I was getting my... I was tearing my freaking hair out. Well, you probably watched, didn't you? Yeah. Fun times, that. Holy fudge. Right, no time to think. There's something trying to munch me. Oh, I don't know. Ow, ow. Oh, no. Oh, fudge and heck. Heart in my freaking mouth. Okay. Do I climb up there? I can give it a go. There we go. Is this a little resting shelf? Can I rest there? No. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. What? That was clearly a ledge. Right. What the fudge is this? All mangled roots and stuff. Mangly mangly. Okay, is this going to be any easier to climb, do you reckon? Um, it looks more niled. I think so. Let's give it a go. It's more pitted. Go on in. Stand there. That's it. Get your health back. And again. That's it. Up this way. Doesn't feel like I've climbed anywhere now, does it? But I have! Oh my god, this is a massive overhang. Is that even going to happen? Well, I guess it is. Oh, fudge. Okay, good. Get your, get your freaking energy back. Let's go with that again. Oh my god, it is. It's going super quick for some reason. Get up there. That's it. Hooey! Look at me. I'm, I'm moving around in my chair so I can get a better angle of viewing. It's not working. Oh my days. I don't know whether I have to go up this high. I've probably overdone it somewhat. But well, there we go. Look, it's over there that I need to go to. get through all this tangled mess holy bejesus right what do you reckon jump to that one over there or just freaking go for it over there or go over there up there to there and jump down there i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna go from for it from here and just bloody hope that i make it this is this is insane! Okay. Insanity level number 12! There we go. Uh, I don't know whether 12 is a high number, but in my world it is. Let's head on over. Come on, come on, come on. Make it onto that bridge. You know you want to. Come on. Come on, little glider. You can do it. Oh, 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 oh. oh I'm not going to make it. Stick to the rocks like Spider-Man! Okay, right. We're up! We're freaking up! You know what? I'm not taking any freaking chances. I'm hitting save right there. Okay. Not far to go now. Come on, my little Shimu. You can make it! Heck yes! We've made it! Okay, right. Hopefully this is our last relic, then. Seems to be a device used to fling this enormous spear through the air. 
on my days. There's only one creature this could have been used to hunt. Oh, the Jabunga! Jabanga, or something. Jubunga. There we go. Relics found, three or four. There's got to be one more around then that I've missed somehow. I mean, I've been to all of them, haven't I? Apart from one, but it's... Let me let me go and have a look at the old journal. Complete the, the display. Well, I've only got three or four, so I don't know whether I should go back yet. What the flying fudge is that over there? Is that the island in the sea? And what's that down there? It's like a little hut. Well, people, I think I should glide down to there, don't you? And then maybe swim across to that while I'm over here. Might as well. I've come all this freaking way. What's the worst that can happen? I die and I go back to um, town anyway. Let's go for it. Here I come to save the day. Mighty Steve. I think I could probably swim that. So I think maybe go to this mossy thing. Whatever that is. And then swim over to that. And find out what that is. Well, today is an episode of exploration and mighty mountain climbing. Hope you're enjoying those people. I think if I was watching this, I'd be like, what the flying fudge? But then again, it's a beautiful planet, isn't it? This uh, world that's been realised into this game. It's very nice. Yeah, I might have to drop and then re-glide. We'll do that. Because I'm running out of stamina just getting here. Hello, giant thing of things. Pajar. Is there a shiny shiny to have here? I mean, you're a giant relic. I think it would be awesome if these giant relics come to life. Yeah. And they're like, um, you know, Shadow of the Colossus. Where you have to, like, take them out. I think that would be freaking awesome if these were actual bosses for us to fight inside a game. I mean, there's a stone horse, there's a big stone fish, there's this thing. Why the fudge not, mate? You know? Little nod to Shadow of the Colossus. I know the devs love Shadow of the Colossus. So. Let's go and have a look at what this thing is over here, then. Is this where I die? I mean, this could be where I die. I mean, they have made it now, so you can swim a lot further. So that's all good. They haven't made it so it's easier to get out of the freaking water though, have they? I mean look, see, see what I mean? Go on, get out of the water then. There we are. Get some get some much loved stamina back. Okay. Going for a swim. Well it looks gnarly under there, doesn't it? That view's pretty cool. The bluest of ocean. Holding down R1 doesn't make you swim any faster, though. All right, I want to see above the water now. I want to see how far I've got. There's some ramps here. Why is this all stormy? Is this like latter area of game or something? Should I actually even be here? we we'll head to that staircase over there, people. Look, there's loads of it underwater right there. Interesting. Sweet, is that going to give me kelp? No. That would be too handy, wouldn't it? What is this place? Well, I've got a massive journey back. That's one thing for sure. There better be something interesting here. I better not have come here for no freaking reason. There's not even a McDonald's on here. They're having a laugh. They're missing a trick. Missing a trick, mate. Build it and they will come, as they say, you know? Right. I guess we scale this then and we have a look at the next level. There's got to be a McDonald's. Oh, crap. I'm going to run out of making stamina, aren't I? I shouldn't have run before. Oh, that was lucky. Oh, fudging stick to the rock. There we go. Right. Okay. Well, that wasn't too difficult. Still no fast food. Right. Um, 
Um, I kind of expected there to be a chest or something here. Just anything. I'm not going to be able to get up there. Maybe this side. Yeah, that side looks a little bit easier. That's one heck of a climb though, Steve. Are you going to go for it? Are you, you going to go for it? Why is your stamina not going up any higher though? Oh, there we go. Right, just rest there for a second. You can do this. Well, you could if you got the right camera angle. And there we go. Are you resting again? Yeah, good. Um, I thought I was stuck at E there. No, I'm okay. Oh, fudge. All right, I'm going to eat one of these. It doesn't give you much stamina back, does it? That better have been worth it. Oh, come on. I just climbed all the way up here. There should be something majestical and awesome up here. There's fudging nothing. Ah, uh, what? Oh man, yeah, that's missing. That's missing a massive trick. That anyway, I've got to head all the way back to town, which is going to take me two days. So I'll see you in a moment, people. I say the moment, but ah, oh, balls. Maybe the secrets were in the basement. Here I come, basement. No. No, I definitely didn't miss anything. It's um, just a shite area, isn't it? Okay. Oh, yeah, just fall through the world. Why don't you? All right, let me work this out, people. Yeah, Johns, where I am in the map right now is where I went to speak to the turtle god, or the sea god. Now, I did this a fair few episodes ago. It's Jabunga part one, and um, I'm going to swim back out there. I'm going to re-talk to this turtle. They were the one that sent me the directions to that cliff. Hopefully, I'm going to get all the way there without drowning. Holy fudge. Why is my stamina going so quick? All right, let's see if we drown now. No. Oh, I'm taking damage. All right, let's try and get out of here quickly. Hmm. Yeah, my health is going down a bit now. Right, let's see if we can stand on this ledge over here. Get some health back. Well, this is not looking good for me, is it? Come on, get out of the water. Right, I better eat something. Dang it. Yum. Yum. We'll eat all this milk. Yummy, yummy milk. I actually like milk after a swim, to be fair. Right, okay, here we go then. Let's go and see this guy. So yeah, they were the ones that gave me the directions to the top of that cliff. So I'm hoping that when I go speak to it now and say, I went where you wanted me to go. I'm not going to hit that stone again. That catapulted me up in the air and I nearly died last time. Cool. So you've seen it, the harpoon device. Yes, it made me sad. Hmm. The way of humans is to destroy. If you do not feel this way, perhaps you're not a defective human. This is what I hoped for the first conversation, to be honest. The first conversation, it told me off rather royally. Run along now and have your people repair you. Become an avid destroyer like the rest. Deny not your heritage. Oh, come on. Don't tarnish us all with the same brush, giant turtle god. All right. Dang it, I came all this way. Right, you know what? I'm going to hit this boulder. That's going to catapult me in the air. I'm going to then glide to the shoreline. There we go. Look at that. Go, go, gadget glider. Heck yes. I'm going to go down to this little island here and then swim from that island over there. That's my plan anyway. Okay, so that's where you get the sea god. 
And the sea god gives you the destination that I just went to and climbed all the way up that mountain. So if you didn't see part one, you don't overly need to see part one now, but you know, if you've now picked up part three, well done you. Part two was me going to speak to the wind god, which is a giant freaking pigeon that lives on top of the mountains over there. So if you didn't see part two, you might want to see part two. Because I can't really cover up part two in part three. Right, okay. I hope that all made sense, all these different parts. Anyhow, I will put them in just a, a mini Jabunga playlist or something, just to make it easy for you. Hello! Come on, my carrot-eating friend! We're off! We're off on an adventure! I'll see you back at town. For some reason, the stamina bar's knackered. I can only walk. Look, I can't make him run anymore. It's broken. I've broken my donkey. My donkey's gone wonky. All right, it's going to take me a freaking years to get back to base with wonkiness of donkiness. You know what? I'm going to jump off my donkey. I'm going to leg it over here. I'm going to run away from him. Look how fast my stamina's going now, for some unknown reason as well. God, this game gets broken very easily, doesn't it? Unless I've just missed something entirely. Right, let's call my donkey now. No, it's still flashing. What? I think I've killed him. No, he's not coming. Alright, fine, we're doing this on foot then. Yeah? My donkey's broke. My donkey's freaking broken! What are these things? I'll have them. Nice! Common seeds all round. Yum yum. Looks like I was here before because there's a load of floating pots in the air. Well, I have some of that. Batch is always handy. Cool, okay, well, we're nearly back at base now. Oh, look, there's some more there. You can stay there, donkey. Right, there we go. Have this. Have that. That's going to get me some a minty or whatever it is. Right. Let's um, get back into base. Now, what I think I need to do to fix this dodgy, wonky stamina bar that's not refilling for some unknown, strange reason is probably do a save right here. Save. And then uh, quit out to main menu. If your town ever disappears, which it has for me a couple of times now, I have to do this. You exit to the main menu, hit continue, go through all these little tip screens. They take ages to load and it usually rectifies any problems with wonkiness. I'm hoping it's going to fix my donkey. Now my freaking health bar is flashing red. That's probably better than my stamina bar. Yeah, there we go. I think the stamina bar might be fixed now. Let's just test my donkey. Oh, he's not very good at finding his way around towns. Let's just make sure my donkey's not broken anymore. Where are you? I can hear you. There you are. Yes! The stamina's now back. Right, we've fixed my donkey. I just don't know about my health bar now. That's flashing as well. Okay. Oh, people just climbing all over stuff. Yeah, look at you on top of the roof. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, the joy of a Gazba. Right, oh, we've right made it back into town. What I need to do is go over to the museum, though. Really, I think my museum's over this way. Nope, that's the multiplayer shrine. Balls! Oh, there it is. It's over there. Cool. Let's go over and let's see if I can do much in there when it comes to restoring the relics of the Jabanga. I think I pronounced it right that one, that time. Jubanga! Yeah, that's it. And I think it's this one here. The Jubanga! Yeah, the majestic Jubanga. There we go. Put that one in. Is it going to say, you're now missing one final pterodactyl? Okay, I don't know where that one is then. A sacred altar of worship for the graceful flying creatures known as Jubanga. When the Jabanga dies, a place where its body falls becomes fertile a grove, where plant life seems to grow more easily and bountifully than anywhere else in, in uh, Gazba. Jabanga hunting machine. That's the one on top of the mountain. So I don't know where to get the last one. You're not going to frame me a bone? No, didn't think you would. Right, okay. Journal. Complete the Jabanga display. Lovely. Show me where I'm missing one. It's not going to. I know that much for free. All right. I mean, that's that's a shopping list for that guy. He's like a little 
sea turd. I, I, I don't think that's it. I've got a feeling this might be it, but it's bloody blank. So I guess we're going to teleport there and go and see what that is. And if not, maybe go down to here, see what the sea floret oasis might offer up. That's the leading hands. What's this then? Withered lens. OK. Right. Um, see, I'm not seeing any other stars that are saying Jabanga on them, you know? I mean, that one's blank too, which I went there. I, I really don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know where I'm supposed to get this other thing. OK, I'll go and speak to this. Oh, no, actually, it's purpose. That's a different mission altogether. I really don't know. I really don't know. I really don't know what I'm supposed to do to get this last relic to pop. I can only assume that I may have missed something down at this giant well whale carcass. I didn't spend a lot of time there. Okay. We've got ourselves a problem. Well, who, who's attacking me? Right, I'm going to scan this guy because I haven't scanned one yet. Okay, so here's a Raz Eye. Take that Raz Eye and the frickin' eye, mate. Okay, right. I'm, I'm going to try and get past those without fighting them. Even though I need to kill like ten of them. That's not what I'm here for. I want to try and do the Jabunga. Jubanga, or whatever it is. I interacted with something down here, and it did give me a little bit of lore. I'm fairly sure that that's pretty much it, but just in case I've missed something. See, look, there's the little sparkly thing there. I've already interacted with it. It'd be nice if it told you if this was part one, two or three. Bones larger than any I've seen. Could these have been bones of the Jabunga? I'm fairly freaking... It's fairly freaking obvious that they are. All I can imagine is that there's something that I've missed somewhere on these whale bones that's going to give me something as far as relics go. It's not like I can interact with the museum to find out from here, you know? Oh, for fudge sake. Yeah, just bounce off of it. Why not? Okay. I don't even know what I'm supposed to look for on here. And I've looked online to see if there's any sort of guides on the last relic of the Jabunga. And I've been to everywhere. I mean, there's nothing on my map showing that I've missed a relic. So I really, I really don't know. I mean, I've just crawled all over this freaking thing. Is, is it? Let's go all the way to the end of its tail. Let's see if there's anything all the way over here. But yeah, I'm, I'm not 100% sure how to get the last relic. No, well, there's nothing all the way out here. And I'd be damned if I'm climbing all the way back up there. So I'm just going to go unstuck. Um, you'll be killed and respawned at the nearest respawn point. Well, let me just hit a save quickly anyway, just to make sure I don't lose anything. My Amity was on 540 not so long ago. It's just dropped to 214, unexplicably. I've had that happen a few times now, and that really does my nut in. Because it takes me an hour to get that sort of level of Amity. Right, well, something I didn't try doing that maybe I should have tried doing is talking to the actual curator of the museum and see if she has anything to offer. This is a little bit freaking weird, to be honest, that I haven't got that final part of the relic, even though I've been to each and every mission point and completed each mission. My amity's back at 558 now, where it should be. Very unusual. Hello there, Olsen. Yeah. You, the relics you've discovered in relation to the majestic Jabunga have been most eludicate, yeah, or whatever that word is. But it seems there is one final piece of information missing. Right, before I'm able to craft this material and hear a scroll ah. display on wherever it could be. Yeah, 
That, 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 that that's exactly. I don't know, mate. I was hoping you could tell me. Okay, chums. Now, I've looked on the Discord and someone says that there's one in the uppermost region called Moa Vale. Now, I haven't got this area unlocked and I can only assume that that's Moa Vale. So I think I'm going to teleport to there and glide over to here, probably take on the Wibbard, uncover this area, find a teleporter there and look for a relic. But there's nothing else to go on other than some very vague instruction. OK, this is very shrouded in frickin mystery. I mean, I'm, that's a mysterious cloud, isn't it? All right. Um, I'm going to jump over there then. We're going to just head north, as far north as we can go and see what happens. Look at that giant bridge over there. That looks like something in our Shadow of the Colossus. Freaking epic. This game is crazy just for exploration, you know? Anyway, we're going to head north and see what we find. Well, it looks like we found another mystical turd. Hello there, turd man. Hey, go on. And he needs loads of stuff. Okay, we're going to have to sort one of these turds out at some point and see exactly what they do. Uh oh! Mate, I haven't got time for this. No one's got time for this. Take that. Get back. All right. Well, the meat that I just got out of him, I'm going to eat it. Yummy. That's only gave me a portion of my health back. I'll eat these two salads. All right. And we carry on with our journey. I'll let you know if anything else eventful or strange happens. Okay, we're coming across withered spawn spores now. And normally, when I enter... Oh, no. Oh, freaking hell, no. Okay, there's um withered creatures right here. Um, This might not be the best place to come. Well, I, I need to kill a couple of these, so... We're going to kill a, We're going to kill him anyway. Oh, no, they've just sent a whole withered army at me. And he's not dying now, for some unknown reason. Right. Take that spider of evil. Yeah, don't you get angry at me. With a hand. Keep away. Come on then. He's going to do the pound now. Go back at him. Ha! 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 We got him, but my sword frickin' broke. Get out of it, spider! No one likes you, spider! He killed me. Ah, oh, he killed me. I don't think I'm ready for that area. Or if I am, maybe I should just run through the frickin' place. And it's put me back at this town. Alright, well, I'm, I think I might have to call that Jabunga Part 3. Um, that we've managed to get all the relics in at the actual relic site and I think I'm going to have to press on on doing other stuff and we'll have to try and unlock that area of the map as and when it happens perhaps in a story event or something alright so next episode I might as well since I'm here is put the crafting bench down and start working on this town so that'll be the next episode alright people well there we go salute to Mondo goodbye goodbye and goodbye again